Hello, uh, so this time I made this type of uh, cholesterol uh, test, and, uh, test bed, it, uh, test circuit, uh, test setup. And uh, this cholesterol requires relatively high voltage, uh, different voltage around 300 volt and minus uh, 60 to 100 volt, and also requires heat voltage 6.3 volt. So this time I made this type of uh, circuit, as you see. The heat voltage is generated, directly generated by the uh, ACDC adapter. Actually, this is a switching regulator. And a minus 75 volt is generated firstly, rectifying the AC100, uh, just a di uh, diode bridge. And after that, I inserted the voltage regulator tube. It's a 75 volt. And uh, generating the minus 75 on the heat of voltage and uh, the minus 300 is a bit difficult to obtain. So this time I will use the uh, external power supply. And the data sheet says that we have to turn on the heater in advance a few minutes before usage. So uh, this time I already turned on the heater voltage. And uh, now I will switch on the uh, uh, reflector voltage, R minus 75. And I will measure the output by using the spectrum analyzer. And currently the, the uh, voltage, uh, high voltage is turned on and I will apply. And uh, I will Yes, you see, oscillation starting, and uh, actually the applying voltage is not enough, uh, 252, and the latent voltage is 300 voltage, uh, 300 volt, but uh, it start oscillate. You see, the uh, marker is 6.6.645.49 gigahertz. And this time, uh, I use just a coaxial cable for very low frequency, so it will have a huge um, loss, a transmission loss. And uh, but the, the output through the loss is around a 2 dBm, and it's a, a, a few milliwatt. And uh, if I uh, apply, for example, 300, it will goes to uh, 20 dBm. 100 milliwatt in theory, but uh, you see it start oscillate at 6.641 gigahertz. Yeah, it is working. Yes, a pump. 